back to my channel. My name is Ashley and I am here today to show you guys how to achieve this eye look. I posted this picture right here on my Facebook, Twitter, and what was the other one? Instagram. Duh. Um, so I posted that picture on those social medias and you guys seem to like it a lot and you guys requested to do you guys requested to do you guys requested for me to do a tutorial on how I achieve that look um, so that's what I'm doing today also I only focused this video on the eyes I didn't really show you guys my foundation I didn't um, show you guys any of those steps um, so if you're wondering where all that went I didn't film it I just wanted to focus this video on only how to do the eye look. So let me know how you guys like this type of video, and if you guys wanna see how I achieved this eye look, then keep watching. Hey guys, all right. So I have already applied my Urban Decay Primer, and I just set that with a translucent powder. And now I'm going to take my NYC Sunny Bronzer, and I'm gonna take that on a Makeup Geek Soft Dome brush. And I'm going to apply that in the crease and upper crease. Now I'm going to take my Sigma Tapered Blending E40 and I'm just going to blend out everything so there are no harsh lines. Going in with the shade Rewind from my Vice 2 palette, I'm taking the fluffier side of the Vice 2 brush and I'm going to apply Rewind in my crease just to deepen everything up. And I'm also going to apply Rewind in the outer corner V area as well, just to deepen that area up as well. <laughs> and now I'm going to take that Sigma brush again and blend everything out. Now I'm taking my ring finger and I'm going to apply Toxic. I'm going to apply that shade to my inner corner and to my mid lid area. Now I'm going to apply my L'Oreal Infallible Eyeshadow in Iced Latte, taking that on a little BB brush, and I'm going to apply this shade in the inner corner to brighten everything up, and just add a little bit of glitter to the inner corner. Now I'm going in with my Stila Magnificent Metals Eyeshadow in the shade Kitten. I'm taking my ring finger again to apply this, to the mid lid just to add a bit of glitter to that area and I think this is so gorgeous. Taking the shade Ambush from my Vice 2 palette, I'm going to apply that shade with my Sigma Pencil E30 brush and I'm going to deepen up the outer V area a little bit and just a smidge in the crease. Now going in with the Sigma E40 blending brush just going to take the shade Dope, and this is going to be our brow highlight color. And now going in with my Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Liner in Blackest of Black, I'm going to apply a basic wing liner, and then taking my Ardell Lashes, I applied those two steps off camera just to make it a little bit faster, and then I'm going to go in and apply my foundation and everything else off camera so it just makes everything go a little bit faster for this video. Going back in with my L'Oreal Iced Latte eyeshadow, I'm taking that little baby brush and I'm applying that to my inner corners. Now going back in with the shade Rewind, I'm taking my Morphe B30 brush and applying this shade in the outer corner and into the mid area. Now going back in with my Sunny Bronzer, I'm taking that on a Sigma Pencil E30 brush and just blending everything out. And here comes the weird faces. I'm taking my Maybelline The Falsies Flared Mascara and applying that to my bottom lashes. And I'm trying to see that I'm still in focus and I'm still in the frame. And we are all done! Yay! Okay, so this is the 
finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this type of video. Um, if you do like these types of videos, please leave a comment below saying you guys like me focusing only on the eyes and everything else I leave out. Um, so yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe if you haven't already um, so you can see future videos of mine. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys for watching so much and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye guys!